Hi, this is Nathan Eddy from HockeyWilderness.com, and I'm here with Tom Brock and Andrew Hine from Historic St. Paul. And currently, we are in front of the Tasting Center at Summit Brewery. Uh, we're here to talk a little bit about the Historic St. Paul Fall Extravaganza Gala, I suppose, um, covering hockey in St. Paul and the history of hockey in St. Paul. Um, Tom or Andrew, why don't you guys let me know a little bit about the, the impetus behind this? How did, how did this idea come about and what can people expect? Uh, well, last year we had a History of Baseball in St. Paul event and that was a huge hit. So it seemed natural to uh, follow it up with a, a hockey analog. Uh, interested in, in joining a, the event, um, what are the, the days? Is it September 15th? It takes place Wednesday, September 15th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. here at Summit Brewery. And not only is it a way to celebrate the history of hockey in St. Paul, but it's also a fundraising event for Historic St. Paul. So we'll have a silent auction and other ways to raise money for so it. So for our viewers who may not know what Historic St. Paul does, why don't you share us a little bit about the story of Historic St. Paul? Well, Historic St. Paul is a nonprofit. Uh, offices are located in the Landmark Center downtown. And uh, it's about 12 years old now, and it's dedicated to uh, preserving and enhancing historic St. Paul neighborhoods. So we administer a loan program to fix up front porches and windows and other exterior uh, curb appeal type uh, elements of, of homes. So this is a way to, we also celebrate anything historic about St. Paul. And this is a way to, uh, to celebrate hockey and to get our name recognition up, up there and uh, just have a good time doing it. So in addition to the silent auction, uh, you've got guest speakers coming in. Uh, who, do, who do you have scheduled so far? So far we have our special guest is Glenn Sonmore, former Gopher, North Star, and St. Paul Fighting Saint hockey coach, current broadcaster for the, uh, the Gophers. And we also have the curator from the Minnesota Wild, Roger Godin, who's uh, an expert in hockey in this state from uh, 1950 and previous. And that's really interesting. Um, the Minnesota Wild are one of the only NHL teams to employ a full-time curator or hockey historian. It shows that, you know, obviously Minnesota and St. Paul in specific have a really deep hockey history. Yeah. And an event like this is a good way for, for the NHL franchise to get back with the community and be able to reach out in, in an exciting way. Um, that's really, are, are we bringing um, a variety of pictures and artifacts for people to look at? Yeah, um, Roger will have a table displaying some of his memorabilia. We've invited a lot of the former NHL and WHA players to, uh, to attend. And we hope to be able to introduce some of them. Uh, we'll also have Chris and Rob's Chicago's Taste Authority, which is a Vienna hot dog type place. They'll be setting up over there in the corner and selling hot dogs and pizza, and they're really good. And so there'll be food available, and of course, Summit's kind enough to uh, let us drink their great beer. So, so we've really got excited. hot dogs, beer, and hockey. Yeah. Two days before training camp opens, yeah. it sounds like a, sounds like a great way to give back to the community and uh, and get involved, get the get your you know, hockey juices flowing for exactly, the yeah. season. Good warm up for the fans. Yeah, no problem. Oops, something. Great. Um, any any last words you guys want to uh, to share with the audience? Well, I'll say two things. One, we we hope to have presentations on the Minnesota State High School hockey tournament and. Uh, the University of Minnesota Gophers at the uh, event. And we're also really uh, grateful for the Minnesota Wild and the support that they're providing to us as a sponsor of the event. Fabulous. Yeah, the Pioneer Press is also a lead sponsor, so we're pleased to have them on board, and uh, they'll be helping us get the word out. Great. Well, thank you guys a lot. Uh, really look forward to, to the event, and, uh, and good luck on the 15th. Thank, thank you so much. Time location. Time location.